hi, I'm Sanks. I'm one of the co-founders of Recall. Welcome. This is just a super quick video to make sure that you're getting the most out of your experience with Recall. What you're looking at right now is my personal Recall knowledge base and you can access your own via the web or mobile app. Uh, as you can see, I'm using Recall for a bunch of different things due to all of my research on health and longevity and even those recipes that I just never want to forget. I'm going to cover four critical things in this video. The first and most important is how you can get data into Recall. The second is how you can customize everything to your liking. The third is how we use a technique called spaced repetition and active recall to rejog your memory and understanding of the content. And the last is our foundations, which is our graph database. Let's get started. Now, there are three key ways that you can get data into Recall. Hit the new button and paste in the URL of any online content. The second and my favorite is download the mobile app and you can just share content with the app when you're out and about and on the go. And the third and most popular, it's one you don't want to miss, is by installing the Recall browser extension. Hit your profile, click install browser extension, add it to your uh, browser. And then the last step that you don't want to forget is to actually just pin the extension so it's right there when you need it. I'm going to show you the power of the Recall browser extension. I'm summarizing this crazy eight and a half hour long video. Just click the browser extension and you can see that a summary has been created in seconds. The summary also has links to any parts in the video that you want to skip to. You can listen to the audio replay of the summary or you can save it into your Recall knowledge base. And this has created what we call the Recall summary card. Now, there's a couple things that I want to cover with the summary card. The first is that it's been automatically categorized. The second is that you can literally edit anything in this content to really make it your own. And the last are all of these entities which have been extracted. And these entities links to other things in my knowledge base. So it's super cool to see that I've actually seen this book previously. It was covered by a podcast that I had listened to ages ago. And if I want to then rejog my memory of this podcast, I can then run a little quiz which has questions on um, all of the content that I would have covered in that episode. Which brings me to the recall review. Any card that I question my knowledge on then gets added to a schedule that's tailored to my learning curve. So I have a personalized schedule to review all of my content. It literally makes you smarter. And the last thing that I'll cover is just our recall graph database. This is that visual representation of all of the content that you've saved in your knowledge base. You can then hone into a particular topic. So let's say longevity. And then I can zoom in and sort of click through some of the core things that I see within uh, my longevity knowledge graph. I'm going to leave it at that. Join our Discord channel if you have any questions. Feel free to reach out. I hope you have a great experience with Recall. Thank you.